rap news street politics and we back to give y'all more of what y'all been asking for man today we hitting the east side we finally here y'all been asking for it we starting in compton now compton got a whole lot going on in it man number one it's probably the sketchiest area in the whole city man these back streets in compton the one ways is going down they got racial tension they got the pot rules they got the crips we jumping right in number 10 south side vadio tortilla flats man this is a sudanio hood did i say gang they beefing heavily with the treetops man right there off compton boulevard between rosecrans and compton they section is jumping man now t flats also been known to be a little bit racist you know what i'm saying they beef with the black gangs out there but mainly you will see these guys get into it with treetop compton largo 36 man we didn't see them all the way by the treetops into the front hoods you know what i'm saying these dudes is all over the west side of compton and before we go man we letting y'all know this is west side compton man west side we're gonna touch on east side later these are all west side hoods man t flats also be for cv 155 now when i say cv i mean compton vadio these are south side sudanio hoods man they be for cv 70 they've also known to beef with treetops enemy fruit town Piru, amongst other hoods like palmer block santana block man the list goes on these dudes are extremely active man they've been to compton for a long time they not to play with now lately treetop has kind of been pushing their hood back in that little war you know what i'm saying but trust me t flats ain't nothing to play with man they've been ringing bells for a long time man the racial divide is serious number nine we jump into their enemigos man the same hood that yg 400 is from treetop pyru again we didn't just told y'all these dudes into it with the t flats man they into it with the fruit towns they into it with the neighborhood pyrus man it's jumping over here of course they beef with the Compton Crips as well. Now, not only is YG from over here, but you know, an old school rapper, DJ Quick, he from over here too. Oleander, Spruce Street, Aron Bay. Man, these dudes is all over here now. Most of these Pyro hoods is gonna be running down Rosecrans. This hood is tucked right in between Rosecrans, Gonzalez Park, where the FTPs hang out, man. This section is extremely active. This one of them Pyro sets before you get to the east side of Compton. But they also known to be for Grape Street and Pocket Hood, man. These dudes be outside in their section. Y'all stay out of here. It's no reason to even be in Compton for real. Number eight on the list, we're going to another Sudanio hood. We're going to Southside Compton Vadio 155. Now, we didn't see these dudes all the way from Greenleaf to the Capanellas, man. They hood is major. Lately, they've been known to be for BKM, best known Mexicans, but they intertwine between Acacia Block the ATF, Spooktown Farm Dog, Nutty Block, and like we said, all the way to the Nellis, man. These dudes is cracking, man. When you see these dudes on the wall, man, you're gonna see who they beefing with. They've been known to beef with the Nutty Blocks. Of course, they beef with the t Flats, like we just said. They beef with the West Side Pyrus. They in the Nellis beefing with them too. Man, the SA Hoods out here ain't nothing to play with. The racial divide is serious. These dudes is jumping CV-155. Now, number seven on the list, Y'all gonna know this hood, man. One of y'all favorite rappers from over here, man. Roddy Rich, Park Village, Compton Crip. These dudes on Wilmington, man, they got a cold street, man. Laurel, when it turned in the center, that shit cracking over there, man. It's like a blind spot. Man, these niggas got the Wilmington Arm Projects. The, the gates blown out on that motherfucker. You can just walk right up in there if you want to, man. It's lit in this section, man. Park Village is jumping. Now, like I said, a lot of these hoods over here, a lot of these Hispanic gangs beef with the black gangs. This ain't no different with Park Village. They beefing with the CV-155s. They also beefing with the Compton Vadio 70s, man. They've also been known to beef with a hood close to them, Anzac Great, Neighborhood Pyru. Now, they've been known to click up with the Nutty Blocks, Atlantic Drives, and the Southside Comptons, man. These dudes is cracking in this section. Like I said, they off Wilmington, Laurel. Y'all going to see the building, man. When y'all off Wilmington, y'all going to see it, and you going to see it's jumping over here. Across from them, they got the original block pie rules. You know they into it with them dudes. They also close to the Palmer block and the ATF, man. It's jumping in this whole section on the west side of Compton. Number six on the list, we gonna come back down Wilmington, man, to a hood we just touched on that messed with the Park Village. Nutty block Compton Crip. Now this hood, man, it's been jumping lately. A lot of out-of-towners been in this set. 
If y'all know that battle rapper that exposed Remy Ma, Geechee Gotti. This his section, man, off the Grandies. They got a one way on Grandy. That shit jumping on that one way, them apartment buildings. But they also stretch down the Greenlee. But lately, like I said, we seen them boys from the rack out here. Man, Geechee Gotti got the lamb in this bitch. They got Lil Reese. They got 16 Shot em. They got Tay Savage. All in the nutties, man. This shit crazy. But like I said, CV155 is over here. They beef with them guys, but they main enemigos, man. The ATF, man. They really going at it with them dudes. Acacia Block, Compton Crip, Spooktown Compton, and Farm Dog Compton Crip. Nutty Block is going at it with them dudes. But of course, they also beef with the Pyrus, man. It ain't no gray area with the Crips and the Pyrus out here, man. You know, it's some sections like we done touched on the Inglewood with the A trays and the families. That shit ain't happening over here, man. These dudes is beefing with the Pyrus. It's up. And when I say the Pyrus, I mean the neighborhood Pyru, Westside Pyru, Campanella. But they also beefing with Lantana Block Compton Crip, Palmer Block Compton Crip, and pretty much all other neighborhood Crips, man, including Twilight Zone, man. These dudes is into it. Again, they section is jumping. Whether it's in the morning, whether it's at night, these dudes is cracking, man, in the grand. Now, before we get to this next set, man, we've been showing y'all some of the craziest hoods and Compton. Like I said, this shit real sketch over here, man. Y'all got to tune in. But before you do that, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. We on the road to 100K, man. Help us get to that motherfucker, man. We've been dropping y'all with straight gems in this bitch, man. Number five on the list, though. ATF, man. Acacia Block, Farm Dog, Spook Town. These dudes is jumping. Alondra and Acacia. Man, Acacia Block probably the most active one between the three of these hoods. They are collected. They three different sets to form the ATF. But Acacia Block is not playing with this shit, man. These dudes are all over the place. Like I said, they beefing with the number six hood, Nutty Block. Heavy. But not only that, we didn't see them going at it with the CV7Os. We didn't see them beefing with the T-Flats. Like I said, man, it's a real racial divide in Compton. So pretty much, man, all these hoods going to be beefing with the SAs for the most part, especially on the west side. But they also beef with Pocket Hood and Palmer Block, man. This is an old school collective, man. ATF, these dudes been clicked up for a long time. So y'all got to watch out, man, especially when you're on location in the Lundra, by the Popeyes and down, the Chevron, all of that. It's jumping in this section. I can't stress that enough. They're not too far from their enemigos. Pretty much everything in Compton is right next to each other. These hoods are right on top of each other. And like I said, these hoods are sketchy as hell, man. When you're rolling through these blocks, man, you can't tell who's popping out of where. You know what I'm saying? Some of these streets be real slim. And man, some of these alleyways be dark as hell, man. Y'all got to stay out of Compton, especially the ATFs. And number four on the list, man. This is a hood that a lot of y'all know about, a lot of y'all heard about. For some reason, a lot of celebrities be jacking these niggas. But shout out to my nigga J Stone, man. He from this. He also be on YouTube, man. Go check his channel out. Fruit Town Pyro, man. FTP. These dudes be heavy at Gonzalez Park. They be in the Douglas Apartments, man. Now, for some reason, they hood that has some goofy shit associated with them. Not saying these hoods don't have hitters. This hood got a lot of niggas in it, man. A lot of real reputable niggas in it. They beef with the treetops, but it's the same hood Soldier Boy and Chris Brown be repping. That's Compton, though. Yeah. You're not from Compton? I am from Bompton. You from Compton? Yeah, I'm from Bompton, yeah. I thought you from Mississippi somewhere. Nah, nah, I'm from Bompton. I'm from California, Bompton, yeah. How? 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 Crazy shit, you know, but also Compton minutes from here, but I don't know what it is if they got big homies that be letting Chris Brown and Soldier Boy do this whole shit. We done seen Soldier Boy get over there and got punked on, you know, he did some bunk shit over there. We done seen Chris Brown damn near fuck his career up trying to hang with these niggas. But for some reason, man, Fruit Town Paru was popping to these celebrities, man. They in the mix, but they also in this street mix, man. Like I said, they beefing with the treetops. They beefing with the T-flats. They hooked up with the 145 Pyrus, basically to go against the treetops. You know what I'm saying? They share them common enemies right there. But they close to Front Hood Compton, man. And they beefing with Front Hood. They also beefing with the East Side Pyru set, my Pyru. And they beefing with Carver Park. These dudes' hood is active, man. Again, like I said, these Pyru hoods be on Rosecrans. These dudes is on the north side of Rosecrans. Now, you can also roll up Acacia on here, too. You can roll through the treetops and end up in the fruit towns off Oleander. You know what I'm saying? As soon as you cross Rosecrans from the trees, you get straight to the fruits. You know what I'm saying? These dudes is hella close. And for some reason, they've been beefing and actively for a while. But they also share that common enemy in T-Flats, man. Like I said, it's a lot going on in Compton. But that's going to lead us to our number three hood, man. 
front hood Compton crib. Now, you may not see these dudes all over the place, you know what I'm saying? But we didn't seen these guys on Granny in the 130th. We didn't seen these dudes on Wilmington and Nord. Damn near, and they in Amigos, the Anzac Grapes. Man, they outside. But we've also seen a T flat stretching all the way from Compton Boulevard all the way into the front hoods beefing with Largo 36. So not only do these dudes beef with Largo 36 too, just like the T-Flash, but they also beef with the T-Flash, man. Like I said, these hoods and Compton is on top of each other. So pretty much wherever you go in Compton, you're going to be in somebody's hood regardless. You know what I'm saying? From the 105 to the 91, wherever you at on the west side or east side of Compton, you're going to end up in somebody's hood. Now these dudes is next to the west side Pyrus, next to Centennial High School, you know what I'm saying? So they over here, they beefing with the West Side Pyrus. They beefing with the Campanella Parks, beefing with Anzac Great and Pocket Hood, as well as Tree Top. It's crazy over here, man. The racial divide, the Pyrus on Rosecrans, the Compton Crips being linked up with each other. This shit is cracking in Compton, man. It's nothing to play with. You can tell when you get up out there, man. This shit ain't nothing to play with. So we just dropping these bombs for y'all. Make sure y'all listen to this list, man. And number two on this list, we're going to jump over to West Side Pyrus and we're going to hit the Campanella Parks. These dudes always been active. This is an old school hood in Compton, man. Now, we done also seen CV-155, like I said, from Greenleaf all the way over to the Campanellas. But that don't mean that the Campanellas ain't there, man. They beef with the CV-155s and they main block lead to the back of their park, man. It's a no-go zone. And it's extremely sketchy, like every other hood on this list, man. Y'all y'all go to Compton and fuck around if you want to, man. You're going to see it. No matter what time you're there, this shit is not safe, man. The Campanella is one of them sets. And regardless, whatever you see, a CV-155, yeah, that may be CV-155 hood, or they may be trying to push into the Nellas, but the Nellas are extremely active. Now, these dudes is pretty much clicked up with the West Side Pyrus. They not fucking with Front Hood, Carver Park, Mona Park, Compton Crip. They not fucking with Grape Street. They not fucking with the CV-155s, like we said, the Tortilla Flats. And they also known to beef with the Bounty Hunters. And we've also seen these niggas that touched up with the Hoovers as well. These dudes ain't scared to go against anybody, man. It's jumping in this section. The Nellas, a well-known, well-respected hood over there. So y'all gotta watch out when you at Campanella Park. But last but not least, and like we told y'all, man, this hood ain't about the number one, number 10 hood, number 10 hood is better than the number one hood. You know what I'm saying? What matters is you made the motherfucking list. It ain't about the numbers on the list. But number one on the list, West Side Bonten Pyru. Now this hood, everybody know about. From dudes like Kendrick Lamar, Jay Worthy, Wale the Sensei, man. This is the original Pyru set. Pyru Street run through here. West Side Pyru Centennial High. Tans Burgers but should have caught that body these niggas is over here man West Side Bonton Pyru like I said they started this Pyru shit on the west side of Compton these niggas hood is large and it's active man Tans Burgers is right on the outside of they shit on 142nd man these dudes hood is jumping they next to the Nellas they next to the front hoods they beefing with Mona Park Carver Park Nutty Block South Side Compton Tortilla Flats CV-155, and all the East Coast sets, man. West Side Pyro ain't nothing to play with. And again, we coming. We know it's Mo Hoods in Compton. This was the West Side. We hitting y'all with a part two of the East Side of Compton. So I know niggas gonna be in the comment section like, oh, you done missed this hood, you done missed that hood. You know what I'm saying? Niggas be all up in the comments doing all kind of shit. But uh, stay tuned in. Hit that like button, hit that sub button. Stay watching, man. The notifications is coming. We doing the east side. We here. This is what y'all asked for. Rap News Street Politics, man.